Oh, listen to that music. I love it. So it's, it's not in keeping with the film, though. Should be a harpsichord. We're going to move this down. And we you don't the... talk out your eyes. Don't talk out Jesus. my eyes. Imagine if you could talk out your eyes. I have nothing to say. Eyes are, are they not windows to the soul? Oh, we don't want that. We have no soul. Jesus. Right. There's a caveat to this week. Uh huh. Okay. Oh. Are you making beef noises in there? Beefy noises. Oh, Jesus Christ. Right. Caveat. Like a wolf's breath. This week's film, as everyone your, can see. Your specs are steaming up. I'm, I'm so hot. Are you having a flash? It's the age. It's the age of what? Your hormones are right. depleting. I am sweating. Right. Caveat. Okay. Caveat. This week's film, as you can see from in between us, The Company of Wolves. What a company that would be. <sighs> 1984. Mm-hmm. And I saw this one night late, just sitting in my room, mind my own business. Sitting in your room. A child. Playing with yourself. A child. An innocent. And on comes this film. It's about werewolves. And I thought, ooh, this sounds <laughs> good. I love horrors. Fan face. Fucking traumatised. I don't know why. Do you remember you with ghoulies? Oh, they traumatised you. I never you? sat in a shit properly till a couple of years ago. <sighs> This it's a film, fucking it? film. It's a glory, though, isn't it? Well, th- th- there was films made in, in the UK at that time that would get away with this sort of thing. Mm. And then it disappeared for many years. And Netflix are bringing back experimental films. They're trying stuff. It's And that's exciting. Is this maybe the purest distillation of fairy tales as they should be? Because fairy tales are potent sexual things. Yes, and this is a and not a Disney's, coming of age Disney's film. taken the fairy tale and sanitised it and spoiled it. They're the only ones that have ever done it. It's all, the fairy u- tales have always been the, awful. They've utterly spoiled yes. it. But fairy tales are designed as moral tales. And people don't realise children... It, p- adults shouldn't speak about the sexuality of children. Agreed. But children themselves are going through hormonal changes and they're developing a sexuality. Yes. And films and like this tap this into is what that. It is, yeah. Fears and p- it's primal stuff. It's very it primal stuff. And and it does it incredibly well. Very well. I think the Thoughtfully. filming not exploitative. No, not at all. But the filming's a little flat. It has it's because it's Granada International. Exactly. That's so where they're you're a losing. low budget. But at the same time, the low budget they've taken I'm led the two wolves, the rest mm-hmm. of it is all stations. I can see that. The budget had three trees. They could build three trees. Oh, that, but they've done it. The, yeah. the, the sets that we'll, I'll get to, they're very like um, uh, Dark Crystal Age of Resistance. Yeah. They're like that, but a bit muddier. It's There is a muddy hue. There's a muddy hue to the but whole But Neil thing. Jordan is a, a, a very good filmmaker. He's, <laughs> He's good. Mm-hmm. But I felt, when I, I saw his first film, Angel, that's amazing. Right. Amazing Angel That's really good 982 He did the crying game I didn't like it I didn't like it The guy from Stargates And I liked the crying game Forrest Whitaker's accent's not the best I just But Stephen Rees Stephen Rees is a great actor He's he's great I really enjoy him He was a dangerous man He looked a bit dangerous Well in the 80s We won't go into it too deeply But an Irish A little Irish lilt Gave you a a debonair dangerous That's right Yeah Mm -hmm. That's right Um, it's uh, you see Angela Lansbury, yes. Brian Glover, oh, Stephen Brian Re- Glover. I love Brian Glover. He is just he's just an angry testicle. Brian Glover. He's a, 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 a northern, throbbing, a throbbing, throbbing testicle of rage. But it starts and they're throwing everything in it. You've got toads, you've got do- every reference dog to everything. wolves. Yeah. you've dog got wolves, crows, yeah. you've got ruins, you've got creepy dolls. It kind of has a feel of the creepy dolls. Remember Robin the Hooded Man. The TV show Robin It's similarly filmed The, the Hooded, Hooded Man, Man. With Enya oh, fucking This hate. could have done With some Enya in it Some Enya would have worked Enya. Enya's awful Oh she's fucking shocking Enya But she lives in a Oh fly away Fly away Fly away Oh it's oh. terrible Terrible She lives in a castle With a cat She's like She's like a a Sinead O'Connor if she'd been lobotomised earlier in life <laughs> yes she's she, again she's the puritanical the Connor the man shadow li- <laughs> she's awful <laughs> she must have made shit loads of money she's super rich it's like that guy that did the sound of silence this is you remember all yeah, that yeah all that he was just fortunes just oh just rubbish it, rubbish music it's Roger Shaw did the animatronic stuff in this which is kind of We'll get into it. Oh, we'll get into the 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 trauma inducing dolls. The trauma inducing dolls. A a dog. 
running. A dog, a do- it's clearly a dog. It's, it's a an dog. Alsatian. It's a dog. At one point, they get some Alsatians and they just get some boot polish on them, a darker they than are, a They are painted Alsatians. They are black-faced Alsatians. <laughs> it's terrible. And it's the Volvo. So yeah. the, the car lights and it's... Always yeah. a Volvo in a film. It's There's most, always Volvos. Well, because people who live in big stately homes always have Volvos. Always have people a Volvo think in a state. Yeah, people a think Volvo Porsches estate. drive Porsches. They don't. No. They need stuff for the dog in the back and the That's horse track. Right. It's a Volvo. Volvo. Now, mm-hmm. right? There's something that happens at the very start of the film that was very early 80s. Mm-hmm. And you don't get it so much. Right. Wide angle lenses. Mm-hmm. It's a little disconcerting, mm-hmm. and especially when the pan with it, everything feels out of shape. Right, okay. And I think that's what they're trying to set up here. I think that was the decision. The older sister appears in her yes. white sacrificial virgin dress, the white dress. Yes. And it's all about, oh, he- hello, mummy. It's a bit... You see David Warner, who saw... He's great, isn't he, David? I Warner? love him. Isn't he good? He's still kicking along, and he's good. he's been in some great movies. He's, um, I think he is 80... 80. 79, 89, he's got a he's quietness in. to him which often works well in films like this. Consider that. He's term. wonderful. He's he not was harmy. the sort of go to Englishman in a lot of 80s. His head getting lost. There's a lot of heads come off in this, but his head coming off in the in the, the Omen films. Wonderful. Oh, spins. It's it's great. Glass, isn't it glass. It spins. That's right. No, it's, 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 it's a great shot. <laughs> that did scare me going past double glazing places for a while. You should be scared. Uh, I uh, was walking down the Lochie Road today mm-hmm. and there's at the, the uh, old folks' home, St. Columbia. Oh, the folk have got their faces pressed to the glass. Pressed the against it. They've put scaffolding up, but there's nothing to catch anything that falls. They're meant to put that up, aren't they? Stuff that falls. And I'm scared to go past it. In Glasgow, when I stayed there, yeah. this woman, oddly enough, tethered her two Alsatian dogs to scaffolding. She went right. to get her, her pint of milk. In oh, my goodness. She came out. The two dogs were writhing on the ground. So she grabbed a hold of them. They'd connected the scaffolding to the mains. So the two dogs and her were electrocuted to death. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, health and safety, man. Health and safety. Ewan McGregor doesn't believe in it either. F- fucking asshole. You know, he thinks people should smoke in petrol stations. But isn't he a notorious cunt? He's a notorious... If you're listening to this, Ewan McGregor, you're yeah, no Sean We know Connery. you're a cunt. Just fuck off your health and safety. Go go and dry your bloody long hair in the bath, you cunt. There we he's go. A cunt. Oh, he's a cunt. I've seen the, a clip of the... Is it Men in Kilts? Oh, that's not him, though. Is that not him? No, that's... Oh, I just saw a clip oh, in yeah, the... It's the, the kind of shit, oh, so he, the kind would of shit he would do. And no, I just it's the guy, it's the it guy, was It's a guy from Outlander and that dude that's in all the, the films. He's Isn't in, that but, funny? I see a completely different cunt and just assumed it was him. Well, that's the thing. Cunts all look the same, well, that, especially white people. That guy, well, yeah, that guy's in that Outlander mm-hmm. stuff, but he, he was wanting to be James Bond... Right. So he made a film oh. where he's an SAS guy. Oh, no, he's, he's very calm. He's so... But he's playing it straight. He goes, right, right, guys. But guys, let's go down that tunnel and everything and let's get the baddies. And the, the, obviously it's the awful. producers have said, he's a wee bit camp for James Bond. I didn't realise he was so camp. I suppose Roger Moore was quite camp, but he's... <laughs> no, ver- he was a dandy. That's not camp. He, he was in very campy films. He was in campy films, but he wasn't camp. He wasn't he was, a, no, he wasn't, no he wasn't at all. But this guy... I spoke to I him on the him. phone. Roger Moore. Roger Moore? Yeah. I went to... Well, stayed in Hall's residence with his daughter. Right. And he phoned for her one day and I answered the phone and it was Roger Moore. There you go. Oh. Nice guy. Uh, now, was it Roger Moore? I think it might have been. It might have been Roger Michael Caine. Roger Moore, I, like. I can't tell the difference between white folk, but... They live beside Wimbledon hmm. and... He was watching the tennis Mm -hmm. and they couldn't tell what the weather was going to be. And he'd phone up furious going, I could see the fucking clouds coming because he could see. So he'd phone up Wimbledon and say, play a fucking game. There's ages yet. Isn't that wonderful? Okay. Okay. Company of Wolves. (laughs) The Company of Wolves. Yeah, so it's... Now, it's per- you, the, the, you this immediately know there's something a bit pervy about this film. Instantly, there's a vibe. There's a vibe. There's a, a, a stickiness. It's based on the Angela Carter stuff, and that was dark fairy tale stuff. Sorry, I've just looked at your t-shirt, and I know that a lot of our um, I don't uh, viewers are going to love that They can t-shirt. love all they like it, it's just a is fashion. That, is that an original? It's a fashion item, I don't care about it. It could be anything. <laughs> um, <coughs> the, the young lassie, white dress and a crucifix on. Oh, yeah. A bit hammery. It, it's... 
I think there's a lot of just straight visuals. And like the, some of this film's a bit on the head, I felt. Yeah. It is a bit. It's um, playing with the tropes, though. It's knowingly. It's a bit of wink, wink, wink. It is a bit wink, but... Wink, wink, but I would prefer it to be a bit more subtle. There's a bit of sibling rivalry. She, You're a pest. And she goes, a pest, 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 pest. Did you ever... You, you know your siblings robbed you and fucked off, but you used to, like... Yeah. You used to just annoy each other. I actually got stabbed. Oh, that's good. My, my sister stopped me. Not deep enough. <laughs> no. The um, the house, I love the interior. Hold on. Uh, Can I show you something? Oh, no, Look straight yeah. in the middle of my head. Do you see a mark there? I do, yeah. That's a knife mark. I thought that was... That's your pineal gland escaping <laughs> that's your That's my head. knife mark from when I was about 10. People should get really... I'm um, getting advertised. Bovril, guys, please. Enjoy it. Well, we want, can, can we get a, a sponsorship oh, from imagine. Bovril? The house has... Like it. It's a patina and it's like a shabby chic. And it, you know that uh, all but the in cities... But that's just a derelict house. The how how the, expensive. The, 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 you know the, the furniture's all covered in Alsatian dog hair and oh it's just God, a smell yeah. of dog farts and... Everything. It's the... She's uh, in her bed. She's yes. taken to her bed. Very small bed. Like Alice in Wonderland. Tiny ah, bed. I think that's deliberate. I thought ah, that. Yeah. Very... She's outgrowing everything. Outgrowing. Everything, and it's, yeah. she's kind of having some kind of fever dream mm-hmm. And she's got the red lipstick on Yes, because she stole her sister's lipstick This lassie is 12 She's 12 in this She's 12 in this Oh my goodness So a, a Neil Jordan, initially he was going to push a lot It was going to be a lot more sexual <laughs> yeah. yeah He was ahead of his time, Jordan He thought, no, this is inappropriate for fucking yeah. a 12 year old So they, they toned it all back So there's, she's, there's pecs in the cheek And there's a little bit of stuff happening Again, this is the, gen, this is the era of What were they called? The Teeny Pops. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now, to our international listeners, on uh, the worst channel in the it's world, the most channel shameful 4, moment of... There was a programme where children are really young. Seven? Odd. Oh, four. Four. Dressed up as Madonna. Dressed up as Madonna with this actual outfit. Yeah, belly buttons. and The the makeup, and they would dance the actual Provocatively. Routines, provocatively. I think and the thing is, I wasn't aware of this no. until years after. Yeah. Like, Look what's on TV. I genuinely think. I don't know if it got on TV. It, it was shown, yeah. Was it shown? And I think they've destroyed it all. They should just burn it all. They should just burn it. It's a Everyone pop. says, oh, everything's history. Fuck that shit. Burn that it. That was designed purely for pedophile marketing. Absolutely. There's n- there, it's yeah, it was disgusting. So. But, but Neil Jordan, he, he even in the 80s, he thought, no, no, too, no. Too far. Too that's far. Good. Yeah, that's good. Um, it, there's a there's doll wind in her bed A problem a sw- I know you have All too common swinging legs The dolls are a I nice mission I almost put it off at this point I'm like I'm that fucking little, my racing That little sailor doll With, with a wee oh. skull like nose And the teddy it. bear The glass eyes I hate it It's See, a nose, nose I'm getting nervous Because I keep hitting the, the, the cup off of the table here And making noise oh. I'm getting nervous Imagine if somebody came in that door And it was that noseless doll The there's kind of clanky music and it's mesmeric electro. The music's quite nice. It was, the music's okay. It's of its time and it, it works just fine, I think. And someone's lost in the woods, and it's that's that primal fear. The, the woods, the 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 dark woods is um, a pre Jungian representation yes. of the dark self. The but shadow early self. man, early man had hated the woods because things jumped to a tree. Could you please them. just stop and pick up on how clever that was? No, I'm, I, t- I take it as granted you're going to write something clever. No, there. I didn't write that. Oh, that I, just came up young there. Game, young game. Okay. Don't look at me. It's a lot of spelling mistakes. <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> they, no, but Ken, so people people have a fear of trees in the dark woods. Yes. So ma- man would build a village they would cut down the trees. Mm-hmm. You wanted to see around you. For very good reasons. Because fucking it was, bears and that community. Yeah. There's an animal that could mm-hmm. eat you or in, uh, around an air Base. You can't have a tank sneaking up your through your trees, no. so you cut them flat. People, we don't They're generally get eaten now. It's very unlikely to get eaten by animals. Unless, That's true. Unless you die in your house and your cat eats you in the bath. I've seen your new cat, and it's about four foot long. It's a big cat. He is 26 inches from the tip of his nose to the base of his tail. That's uh, very similar to my cat. That's a big animal. That's a big cat, plus tail. That's a big animal. That's a big animal. He's big. He will kill you. He'll kill you. I think he could kill your cat. Your cat's a bit molly coddle. I just feed my, my cat. My cat meat. is a dandy. Well, That's dandy. the difference. Then she gets pursued by a huge and randy teddy bear. I hate it. I hate it. That guy in that suit. He'd been, have, have you ever worn a costume like that? Very hot. No, but this is, I think this is to do a lot with uh, children that sexualise things around them. 
Well, the thing is, they use those dolls for abuse cases when they tell. <sighs> that's fucking creepy. But that's a thing you liked as a child. You thought your toys came alive. Can that the book Indian in the cupboard? Yeah, stuff like that was interesting. I used I to never like thought that. that. Did you never think your Lego came alive? No, you'd always run into the room trying to catch some doing shit. <sighs> fucking I was no. into that shit before Toy Story. I, I'm sure that's a very common thing very with children. Common. But I never felt. My toy, toys were alive. No, and then I didn't have them we very didn't long. Didn't have any toys. They were all, sold <laughs> they were all for stolen. Smart. Yeah, but the the the, the fucking the, the bloody noseless sailor appears and tries oh, to molest them. Right. Her. Okay. At this point last night, mm. I'm not kidding you. I got the full sweats on, like just starting You're here, sweating, thinking about it, and my heart was racing. This film affected me, mm. and I was genuinely. I, I thought it was a creepy, but scary she, but film. She, she escapes the molesty toys. Yes. And runs right into the bloody wolves. There's a great bit. Where oh, now this is a great scene. Though. This, there's like rats in this doll's house, and then yeah. I love the the organ pipes, which are like mushrooms. Yeah, and they're going. Hoo, Hoo, and the noise. That's a bit dark, crystal. It's a, yeah, but and it, giant toadstools acting from the dogs. They're all it's, just sitting there. Oh, the dog work great. in this. The dog and wolf stuff. The toads are great in this. The toads a shout are fine. out to the crows. Everybody's Everyone's giving it their the There's some spiders later. Yeah. There's a white rabbit. He steals mm-hmm. the show a wee bit. It's good. But there's owls. A big the tweet tweet too. Do you know that's two owls? That's two owls. Two owls. That's yeah. them calling each other. Yeah. It, so the painted Alsatians. There's that kids book, The Wolves of Willoughby Chase. Yeah, but. No, I can't read. We made a film, I think, with Stephanie Beecham in it, and there's wolves in it, but they put these funny tails on them, like rat's tails, and it made them creepy. Creepier. There's a slow motion kind of horror chase. Yeah, but it's... a little bit like a Duran Duran video. It's very of its time with the use of slow motion, but I think in this context... And the red glow. Did you like the red glow? The eyes are great. Yeah. Just a, a simple use, so using the dog's natural eye and a good yeah, light yeah. direct right back That's into the lens. That's how people go hunting rabbits, hey, you go with a torch. And they're looking Lamping. And lamping. Used to do that. Uh, terrible thing. Terrible thing. Mm. Poor rabbit's just having a wee chill out at night and you shoot. Fucking sick. She's a good screamer, this lassie. She screams well. Screams faints in terror and it I was, cuts. I couldn't hear it because I was screaming. Screaming over your screams. Oh. Eight, and then it cuts. So we're not... We've went from modern day... Yeah. ...to the dream world. It's... And now she's entered the dream and she's at the funeral. She looks pretty good for a corpse that's been chewed to death by wolves. She does. Unmarked. They've just Unmarked. gummed her to death. But when she's seeing this death, this represents her sister moving on. Does her sister's now? moving on to maturity. When When is a village supposed to be set? Because you initially think it's medieval, but they've all got guns. I like the whole thing. It's any time. It's just this weird um, it's, amalgam it's what, of stuff. It's what this, yeah. this you girl's them books. to have a phone. Yeah, this girl's books have all blended, blended together in, mm-hmm. in her mind. She's kind of not too displeased with the death of her sister. She has a wee smirk to herself. She's quite happy. Angela Lansbury. Now, Angela Lansbury is. Still make it, still in films, still going strong. Murder She Wrote must have made her so I much love money. That. It's so good. Murder How She much Wrote money is great. Do you like Diagnosis Murder or a uh, or a uh, Murder She Wrote best? Diagnosis Murder. Uh, Dick Van Dyke. Uh, no. Did they Murder, ever do wrote, like a, a charm. Did they ever do a double dunter like the two shows together? A mash. Oh, I don't know. Angela Lansbury meets Dick Van Dyke. Oh, wouldn't that, that be amazing? Because they're a couple of hoofers. Yeah. Total stage Did actor. you see Dick Van Dyke a couple of years ago in the Mary Poppins remake? She's still giving it Laldi. 94 or Aye. something on a table tap dancing. Uh, a lot of dancers, it's good for you. Fucking hell. healthy. Well, I, uh, my mother had a friend mm-hmm. and she was just about to turn 100 when she died. Uh, and Did she tap dance? One day, we were all invited up at Christmas and she used to get invited to my mum's at Christmas. She had no family. You really lived there, everybody. And she, used to, and she went, Derek, what was it? She goes, you know what? She says, now I know I'm an old bitch. And I went, well. And uh-huh. she goes, I know I'm an old bitch. And she says, but I only realised three years ago, standing at the bus and I looked around me and there's all these old, old people, but they're a lot younger than me. And I just realised I'm an old fucker. And I burst out laughing. But she got into her ni- late 90s before she realised she was old. It's all in here, man. I'm 17. That falls apart a little bit because mirrors. <laughs> yeah, but and then she died of tremendous old age. But you just run out of road eventually. Yeah, that's, that's it. Good. But I thought it was a lovely. 
Hey, but Probably the the, 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 the funeral's a bit fruity because like she's kind of a wee smell and that ginger haired bairn who's right Randy himself. He is. Someone's he, in that well water. I think he represents his short a youthful testicle. <laughs> I don't he is b- He's b- Brian Glover's b- b- son And yeah. he's like He's trying to catch her eye But isn't Lansbury creepy in this? She's so creepy in it She's terrifying You expect her to be To turn into a wolf Yes she's, uh, And she's she's a wee bit It's like she's like The witch out of Hansel and Gretel Yeah is she It's like she's kid? going to eat, the, going... eat the door You're my favourite okay? But this is where this, this kid Uh you know when you go to your grands and you, you you're too young, mm-hmm. so you go. I don't want to go to grands. It smells funny. I don't. Oh. Well, that's what she represents. Mm-hmm. But as she gets older, she starts respecting her grand. Yes, and it changes, and she mm-hmm. starts realizing she's a person and not this. Well, you monster. never have. You, you, it's a shame because you never have. You never have an adult conversation with your grandparents. Mm-mm. But it would have been interesting to have a proper conversation with them about stuff, but you just never did because they were I'm, dead before I you. didn't know them. No, I, I, think I did, but I was a child when they both died. I what was a young, young... One pair of grandparents was around seven or something yeah. when they died, yeah. and then the other ones never spoke to me because they thought I was gay. Because okay. I had long hair. Well, oh, So okay. they, said, uh, they said to my mum, they said, listen, we know he's one of those homosexuals. She went, what? Why do you know that? I said, look at the length of his hair. Oh. Uh. <laughs> That's quite they never spoke to me said, again. Maybe better. You never had to speak to them. Uh, Do you like there's some shots so like the village and it's like the sunny uplands and you see the spires and all this kind of stuff. Yeah, all, and like a matte painting. And the, or the painting and the models. And I like the village, the forced perspective yes. going over the bridge. She had to kiss her dead sister on the lips. Oh, I wouldn't do it. Bovrally, wouldn't it? I wouldn't do it. To Have you ever felt a no dead refri- body? No refrigeration, but ice cold. A dead body. Yeah, they're not what? cold. It's not ice cold. Ice cold, yeah. They just it's like, well, they oh. do keep them refrigerated. Oh no, they have felt. Yeah. But they're not cold. If they were sat in this room, they they wouldn't be ice cold. Wrong. No, the the ambient temperature would heat them up a little no. bit. It's like no, no. If you're putting a steak, if you're cooking a sirloin steak, yeah, you're told to take out the fridge and put it in the room, and it heats up, and it gets quite warm. Yes, but when you have a corpse in front of you, uh huh. Right, it's 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 no good. You have warm to move, as a live you have to move it because uh-huh. it because it died sitting up, uh-huh. and you've got to help uh-huh. the the district nurse that comes uh-huh. up. And you, holy shit, icy cold. It's not gonna be icy cold. It in is a hot icy room. cold. Not in a hot room. You d- I'm telling you, but that makes There's no chemical sense. Chemical reactions. It makes it. Uh, cold. The chemical reactions is it starting to break down, which creates heat. Have you never sat in no, a compost no. heap? No, that's why snakes go into to hibernate, nice and cozy. The next time you kill someone. Wait three, four hours, touch them. Icy cold, it's weird. I don't know, I'm not sure about this. People yeah. write in, a lot of the a lot of our listeners icy. have touched a corpse. A lot of them. So um, the priest's hilarious in that. He's that Scotch actor. No he's a nice turn. Why is the priest in this gentle and comedic and kind? They're usually evil or hard. Well the the, yeah, the, the, the religious element in this is normally it's like paganism. Is seen as this lovely pre pre religious thing, pre Christianity, yeah. and the Christian priests always like hard and puritanical. Yes, and he's the out to get the witch mm-hmm. and burn the witch. He, you know, in this, he's not. This is nice, but he's yeah. not. He's a priest, but he's playing it like an amiable Scottish vicar, he's like a minister, a, just a normal. Yeah. yeah, this is a very different view. Yeah, is this because Neil Jordan's Irish and maybe has a better view of some but is religion? He a, or is he, it, I, I would don't say know. This, is I don't a, know. this isn't a very Catholic film, is it? No, not at all. This no. is this is There's no Catholic. This is just guilt purely coming of age. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Where are we? The smile of you. <gasps> There's now, a toad in the grave. Hold These on. These toads get everywhere. Everywhere. Now hold on. Granny Lansbury gives some advice. Don't stray from the path. Yes. You've strayed from the path a long mm-hmm. time ago. And never trust a man whose eyebrows meet. Now, I have a small issue. Is that an oasis? Yeah, well, that's fair enough. But I do get a little. Do you shave it? Yeah. Or oh, you vain cunt? I get rid of it. No. It's terrible. He actually, actually says, The wild beasts know no mercy. They wait for us in the woods, in the shadow. And once you put a foot wrong, they pounce. This is all sexuality. This ab- the apple has a maggot in it, and it's how somebody's obviously dug a wee hole, mm. put a wee maggot in it. It's lovely. Never stray from the path. Never eat a windfall apple. Never trust a man whose eyebrows meet. That's 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 rules well, to live by. 
I don't know, but by the time I got to the end of this, I had suspicions of a fucking werewolf. Uh, <sighs> an easy way, get how you know. No. Open a tin of corn beef. Oh. To see how you react to it. Are you a werewolf? No. <laughs> oh, you could take a, a. Oh, here's one. Take a tatty peeler. Yeah. And just peel off your nipple, and there'll be hair underneath. What? Why would you think of that? Just that's the way. Well, you so anyway, and say, Granny, there's a barn owl. Yes, Be- most beautiful bird. I, I love a barn owl. My dad's got a stuffed barn owl on his wall. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Yeah, I put it on my shoulder and posted a picture online years ago, and people thought I had a real pet barn owl. <laughs> it's very beautifully stuffed. Oh God, mm-hmm. I've I used to go shooting. And sometimes uh-huh. Uh-huh. The, 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 the reeds Silent. They would fly over Silent. you Not a sound It's actually like You're not sure if you saw it or not Silent ghosts Incredible Yeah They've got these kind of round shaped wings They're not very fast But they're just still Oh they just go right stealthy. over your head not, yeah. a, not a sound I like the way Yes Make and mend she, The granny was knitting a, a shawl for the daughter mm-hmm. She's died Chewed by wolves She says it's your It's your, yours now, yours yeah. now. You're my favourite now Bright red yeah, Red Riding Hood. Yeah. See, you see where it's going. Soft as a kitten. Now she tells a story. She's a naughty granny, isn't she? she Twinkly. Is. She's a twink. But that twinkle, mm-hmm. I'm kind of. St- even though I know she's a goodie, uh, I'm still oh, scared it's of. Designed to. I'm scared of her. The wolf who ate your sister was hairy on the outside. When she died, she went straight to heaven. The worst kind of wolves are hairy on the inside, oh, God. and when they bite you, they drag you straight to hell. This is not good. I was nervous at this point. I've seen this film several times and I'm still nervous. Yeah. I only watched this film to try and overcome the fear of it. And last oh, night this was, was the worst. A challenge. What time did you watch it? Uh, about half seven. It wasn't well, too bad. Well, forgot to mention, this is only like an hour and a half long. It's Perfect a short time. film. Very short. Short well, film. Hour and 31. It was a long hour and a half for knuckle. me. Knuckle. Bare knuckles, not oh bare knuckles. Oh, my God. Ah, white knuckle. White knuckle. That's it. White knuckle. Um, a country wedding. Do you like the structure of the film? It's like it's got a lot of vignettes, and little vignettes of the lovely, stories. Lovely, but this is this is uh, uh, a good fairy tale, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. And, and the, the old remember they that thing. It well. I am the fairy. I am the storyteller, and my story must be told. That sounds familiar. Didn't um, a deer in that say, "Won't you come into my wild wood?" No, you're oh. thinking of a uh, wind in the willows. No, not wind in the wi- wi- willows. They had the wild wild in the wild wild wood. What, what? Paul Weller. Oh, he's oh. terrible. He's, he's he had an album called Modern Classics. I keep telling people that Modern Classics was the name he called his album. Oh God, that's that's not vain at all, is it? Tilt. Get a new haircut, Paul Weller. He's no hairy. He's I a, called my band uh, supporting. Uh, and no one would put it on their uh, posters because I thought it was free advertising. Oh Jesus Christ. Hmm. Anyway, so it's a country wedding. Now I've been to a few country weddings. Yes. Up north, what they used to do is, and this is, they still do it, it's a thing called a blackening. Wow. And it's where they take the bride and groom and, like, cover them in shit. Oh, yeah, we'll get that in and Dundee. And drag yeah. them about in the back of a tractor and bogey. They do that. Not far from where I live, there's a roundabout, a circle. And people get tied on. And, they, and a, you'll always see a Land Rover That's and someone... That's probably got some pagan route. Oh, yeah. It's and a fertility thing. And there's some poor thing. guy covered in... Treacle tar and, and tar, treacle. Yeah. And he's feathered and there's, there's a bra on him. And they just leave him. Oh, they leave them for the locals. They're there for about ten hours, and then people will have to go up and feed them. Do you need a piss, son? We'll take up a bucket take or something. Wee willy take it out. Oh, it's it terrible. It off. Yeah, there are an earthy bunch of shaggers in this village. <sighs> earthy shagging. There's a lot of shagging. And Stephen Rea is dangerously Irish, as we've spoken about. He has a presence. I like him. The lassie has a, a Dundee ginger vibe. There's a lot of ginger hair. People. A lot in of this. ginger and. She has the the Dundee ginger hair which goes straight up. Ah, straight up. Anti gravity. They should cut that Electric. Dundee hair off, put it in airplane wings. You could use You'd it. You need a string to hold it them would down. It's good to keep slugs off your lettuce. I'm wonderful. See, I thought, you know, helping mankind, but. Well, so am I. Stopping your lettuce. Your lettuce. People need lettuce. But there's a bit where uh, they go to the, the bed, the marital oh, bed, yeah. there's a hedgehog in it. Hedgehog. The hedgehogs go. Like a fucking piglet. They make a funny wee noise. Uh, they don't. That was a weird noise. It's a, it's that. it's very potent. This scene, and she's in the shadows. Come out of come out come out of the shadows. Let me see you. And he's got the bruise. Oh, they're right across. Oh, oh. and he stood in the hedgehog. 
and he's but they're just about to get down to it, and he he makes he looks at the door and he's and drawn. There's, there's the moonlight, moon. and he's drawn to and it. He's drawn to it. And he I'll went, just go out to the yard for a moment. Got something to the do. Call of nature, and he mm. says he's away out for a piss, and she's she waiting. waits. She waits. She waits again. I like to go in the middle of the night and shite in my neighbour's lawn. You said this several times, and I thought you were joking. No, but I know. Well, the my story. lawn, my lawn care is scant. I kind of trim it and I water it, but it's a bit patchy. Okay. And neighbours lawn, they put that blood and bone on it and stuff, and it's right. beautiful. I like to do a big shit in it, and it leaves white mark. It just makes me happy about myself. I'm not going to say where. Mm-hmm. And I'm not going to say who. Mm-hmm. But there's someone from Dundee that has a drone. They shouldn't have a drone in Dundee. And no, but they go elsewhere to fly. It. Uh-huh. Very sensible. And they've fitted it with a little pack, and this pack is remote control as well, and it carries liquid. And they fly it out over someone's quite famous green area Uh and it deposits weed killer and they fly and draw giant cocks over it all the time. The next day, they go out and look at their their green area. That's a low effort. Giant cock. All the technology that goes into that drone, the gyroscopic (laughs) stuff... The camera, everything. So GPS, it G- talks to satellites. It does everything. And basically you're doing, you're just drawing, drawing. a cock on like a blackboard. It's just yes. the same. Yes. But I suppose before, people drew the cock and balls and Neanderthals drew them in caves. They've some carved on the, right. irim- the pyramids wait, in it Egypt. it goes further. Right. The technology is so great. Aye. He doesn't fly it and he plans the route and draws the cock on his tablet and sends the drone off, and it does it. Is there not guys that you love going on their GPS journeys so they make cocks and balls? Yes, yeah. I've done it. Yeah, I've done it in Dundee. I've done it on a Strava and a journey, and I went and done a huge... And you always tell me you're a busy man. And I went and done... This was many years ago, and i done a huge cock and balls, and it, it went from all the way from this side of the town right down to Moneyfeath and uh, back. Uh, Took me hours... But there, was a, there was a farmer doing in England I think he was fed up at the low flying jets going to be properly so he wrote on the top of a roof again fuck off the RAF or something but all the pilots were chanting to each other so they were all going to have a look at it so he had twice as many jets going, oh that's wonderful yeah. the best one I've seen <laughs> is I think it's uh, it's some airport but mm. it's not it's not Denver Right, and someone has a house nearby, oh. and they've put welcome to Denver on the top so people panic when they're in their plane isn't that lovely Unless somebody panics and tries to hijack the plane. <laughs> That's coming in for landing. There's nothing you could do. Uh, there's more wolf dogs. So she looks out and she thinks, you would. Yeah. He's been he's fucking eaten by these wolves. Oh. And Once going, again. He's a travelling man. He's fucked off. He's the fu- it's in search his blood. party goes out. They don't believe there's it. There's not a hair, not a hide of him. And I love this. They came and took him when he was making water. Yes. When a man is at his most defenceless. I carry a knife when I pee. I think when you're taking a shit, you're probably more... Having a pee, you can still... Again, if I was sta- standing having a piss and some wolves came to me, I would just... I could keep now, pissing while I was running. If you were shiting we your breaks down, you'd be more that, vulnerable. This is, this is a thing that uh, I am aware of. And there's a current thing on Twitter about me because I mistakenly told everyone I have a duvet knife, which I do beside my bed. Yeah. Because I get stuck in the covers and you have to cut your way out. Yeah. But you have a toffee hammer as well. I have a toilet hammer. Mm-hmm. I have a toilet hammer. It's an old, lovely wooden handle. I got it out of a place not far from here. Lovely. And I just leave it on let the him, shelf. Let him speak. Behind the toilet. Young, young so gear, if I'm young peeing, mm-hmm. right, mm-hmm. and anyone comes in, whoa, whoa, whoa. there could be a sudden freeze. One, two, three, four. There I learned that last week's film. There could be a sudden freeze and your, your urine becomes like an icicle. Oh. You'd have to shatter it quite a way away from the Hammer. shaft, or you could shatter your penis. In but the this coal. is an emergency. You're just in the middle. Has anybody ever dipped their willy into like liquid nitrogen? Oh, there's someone's done it. Of course, and then has. snapped off. Yeah, someone's done called it. Called it doing yeah. a Terminator. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to reform, is it? No, it's just not. reformed. I bet wrong. The, the person who done it, I bet they believed. I'll add some heat to it. Oh no. Oh, remember the <laughs> woman tried to dry her poodle after she'd washed it with putting it in the microwave? Yes. People are fucking people imbecile. are stupid. Are the people that put a ice, a, a kind of de icer stuff in water for the birds? For the birds, yeah. So it doesn't That's freeze. actually quite common. People do that quite a lot. I fucking hate people. And kill the birds. And you can usually tell where that is because uh, the bees will make blue 
Um, oh no no that's not uh, no. Is that not the ice? No, it's see uh, they were doing um, they were putting out the uh, there was bees near like some place that was it was sugar sugar syrup was some description right. and the bees were like gathering the sugar. Because I think it's in New York they couldn't get. Uh, honey that would be the normal colour No Because they were getting all their sugar from but, elsewhere but, but I'm led to believe that city honey is really nice Because well there's such it's a weird range Weird, uh, weird, weird range of different <laughs> Because if you get like heather honey if, if bees are eating one honey It's quite a simple taste But yeah. bees that are taken from all different crops is nicer I love a bit of honey It's like if you kill a seagull mm-hmm. Which you're not allowed to kill seabirds in this country No But if you if you were starving You kill a seagull It tastes it of fish and it shit It's fish. horrible A cap of Kayleigh is believed to be the worst one But a Dundee one will taste of burgers That's all they eat And human vomit And vomit There is that Oh god someone vomited at the end of my path the other day And there was a local cat just And then it's went to the house and it's Mummy Yeah It was just face. She's like Oh, oh that's snorbid. tasty Oh, pe- oh peckle petals <sighs> And it had that sick beer smell. Oh, it was it was quite chunky. awful. It's always chunky. But I, I didn't want to take a bucket down. So I, I just I just left the cat. Jay's fluid, right? Okay, that's the best thing to put the down. Get rid of him. Um, um, so she's okay, he's gone. He's, that's she has to move on, and it's a man not too shy to piss in the pot. Yes, this is who she now marries. Years later, now she's got children. Now it's a Dundee home life. Oh my Chickens god! Chickens and shouting. Is she now this actress? I understand she was in her, in her moment, in yeah. her role. Oh, she's but she's rough with those kids. Oh, she should be. And I, d- I didn't like it. No, she you was thought really rough with those kids. She and started shouldn't. crying properly. This wasn't. Well, she's not their mother. Yeah, but this was. But I've told you before, people that want their kids to be actors. Oh, we need a child to play a victim of a like dog attack. Can we need them to be lying <laughs> in a mortuary? I mean, little Steven's perfect for it. The fight for those roles. It's. I don't like. Even it. imagine you're in a film. And they're using a picture of a child to represent a child that was killed. I wouldn't, yeah, that's, no, that's not for ki- me. That's I, not for that's me. That's weird. I should say at this point, if anyone notices that you do get this on a video version as well, mm-hmm. it'll be out in the future at some point. Yeah. But if you're watching this, uh, you'll notice that there's better lighting. Softer light. I th- hopefully the lighting's well, better. I, uh, I Professional you, lights. I told you to put some Vaseline on the lens. That's what they used oh. to do with the old starlets back in the day. I don't need Vaseline. Just put you on your half. You need a lot of Vaseline. Well, now. this is where all our patron money goes into improving the studio. Look at this a diffuser up there. The stuff you kind of see on the roof and that. It's just... Like, he wipes bogies and fecal oh, there's, matter. There's everything. So that gets like me Bobby onto the Sands point. It's like Bobby Sands' living room. Mid, midway. Aye. You could, if you like the show, you could support us on Patreon. The link is below. I know. How about that? Is that smooth? Yeah, it's very good. Do you know what link below means? No. No, I d- <sighs> missing link. The where have we got to? <laughs> oh yeah. So one winter's night, and I like it because it's salt they've used. Yeah, a snow machine. It's, it's really good. Stephen returns, but he's it's, got long. It's hair. like you coming back from Nepal. And he's dishev- That's exactly what I looked like. I'm not even joking. He's become a hippie. Yeah. He comes back. It's like Robinson Crusoe. And one, it's like one, one little handmade bracelet, and you feel like you're that. spiritually he's awakened. Like, I'm starving. Yeah. And she's like, she goes and gets some fucking some soup. He's like, I was, hey, where have you did been? You, did you hear me the first time? Well, he's angry he's, now. Where did these three kids spring from? And he's like, oh. From whore. Whore. Adulterer. And then he just starts peeling off his skin like a satsuma. Okay. That's he a good effect. He's so angry. He puts his fingers under his flesh and pulls his face That's off. That's a good effect. I'm terrified. Uh, yeah. I'm terrified. It's... He it still gives feel me that. It. It's now I watch it. It's old. It's dated. And he's it's not washed his hands. Jesus, though. I, I, the, the, the thirteen-year-old that saw this, he goes into like what I like to call the Derek Findas stage. Oh Jesus! It's like it's like beef jerky. It's yeah. skinless. Yeah, I've I just shaved recently. Yeah, I know well, I can't it's... shave, it and now I've got the same thing going on. Yeah, yeah. The and it's 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 a very mechanical wolf. It's clearly mm-hmm. mechanical. This was a period, the 80s was all werewolf transformations. Yes. American Werewolf in London's the best one. It is the best it's one. It's pre- premier. The Howling. Um, oh, that's not good. But this one in its own way has a kind of puppet, puppet. It works. This one works because yeah. this one's actually painful and brutal. Yes. Where they my demonstrate one, my, American Werewolf is painful, but yeah. this one, oh, God. The, it, raw. It's raw. My problem it. with it is, the wolf isn't. They've, they've, they've spared the Vaseline. They should have made it slimier. 
Yes. It's a little bit dry. There's a good bit where the the the, head, the neck kind of comes out the body and it's quite. Oh, that's sl- yeah. It's, yeah. I quite like good. the design of and it. And his hand and so everything. A, the hand. Oh, um, he should have been a bit moister. I like things so moist. The trauma you know. begins. The hubby comes in and lops his fucking Just head. Just drops his head off. No messing with that guy. No. And a beautiful effect. So the wolf's head goes into the <gasps> Best milk. Best part of the film. Yeah. That's the, the wolf bit. head falls into the milk mm-hmm. and it floats up human. And it's Stephen Rear's human head. Beautiful. Yeah. Now, mm-hmm. she does a weird thing. Uh huh. She goes over and starts touching it. He and looks makes the same the day I married him. Fucking what fucking? So this is a Dundee home life. Who you did? Who you did? Speaking of that decapitated head and that bucket of milk, I'll show you. You fucking cow! Whack! Yeah. Oh, she kind of loved him. He was more glamorous and dangerous than her husband. She, her new husband. She settled for a stolid man. Ah, but this is the thing. This is showing this side of the dangers mm-hmm. of your sexual awakening. Mm. That you get attracted to the the bad boy. The bad boy. But you, the the woman. Mm-hmm. In that situation, always says he's a bad boy, but he won't be bad to me. I can change him. Yeah, yeah it's like it's, and, and it's, it's a, like it's a, women who tale. women often people will often yeah. have somebody an abusive partner and they'll leave them and go for another abusive partner. Exactly. It's a weird thing. It's a women strange. like a bit of rough, and you don't yeah. get rougher than us. Oof. No, and well, but, no, but well, fucking people used to should get, have thought that through. You should have. People yeah. used to get Ian Huntley gets fucking love letters. Yes. Yes. They got a ripper. It's yeah, a, what that's, mad as shit. It's mad. This guy turned into a fucking wolf and she's still into him. That's kind of hot, though, eh? Isn't it? it well, it's like the vampire thing. I don't well, get it. Well, all that Twilight stuff, they just emasculated I love them. both. I love them. Oh, I hate those shit. Both. I, they took a vampire and made them glittery in the wolves. I have them on DVD. I've never seen them. Because they are literally the worst films ever made. And the more you watch it, the is more. Is there decapitations in them? Yes. Okay. But the more you recognise the terrible writing, the, it's, no, it's no, just but, awful. No, just a cash grab. Yeah. I yeah. mean, it's the worst thing you've ever seen. There's one scene in it uh-huh. where the vampires don't know what to do. So they go on Google to search the history of. Werewolves or something. That's what everybody It's does. brilliant. Okay. It's just rubbish. And they'll drive Volvos. Not to be trusted. Remember, in Lovejoy. Remember Lovejoy? Did, 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 what was the Lovejoy theme tune? Oh, I can't remember. Well, he had a Volvo. Right. Because that's okay. what all antiques dealers have. You that's have a right, Volvo. An orange state. Volvo. You have a Volvo. But it wasn't cutesy enough, so he got like a, a Morris Minor. No, and it said to no, him, you wouldn't have a Morris. It's a Volvo, Volvo you'd have. But it's Volvo is cutesy. Yeah. yeah, cutesy. A, so Angela's like animals, all wild animals. She's got a bit of a smoker's pucker, Angela Lansbury. You notice she likes yeah, a fag. Yeah, she likes it. He, now, our, don't our I scarf deserve a kiss is a for my story? Yeah, and this is where I thought, oh, oh. And you're, you're and she, unnerved. And she's sharing the bed with the granny farts. Yes, but this is again, going back to the gr- grannies are kind of scary. Mm-hmm. And then the older you get, you get some well, respect it's for that, them. Well, it's that double generational thing. Yes, you're meant to be separate from them, especially yeah, young, mm. and then you gain respect as you get no older. No wonder she's no sleeping. But she gives her a little knowing glance, mm-hmm. the lassie. Was, eh, then they're out for foraging. There's more amphibians. Her scarf, Lansbury's scarf, uh, hisses at a snake. Oh. Her scarf's alive. Now, this is the young girl. Oh. Would, you know when you're a kid? A you're python. G- you're, yeah, in the middle of in an English Templeton forest. Woods py- but... You know when you're scared of certain things that are about their house, it's mm-hmm. like... Yeah, a clock, there could be a, a, a grandfather clock. A clock you don't clock. like, it's yeah. a bit intimidating, yeah. and this represents that. So there's a lot in this, there's a lot to break down. If you really go through every scene, it's really been thought about, but mm-hmm. you can't see the budget restraints. Yes, with you the, can't two, the two them. wolves and three trees. <laughs> uh, the village, it's kind of got a vibe, it's a bit like Invergauri. If Invergauri was glamorous. <laughs> and it's just filled <laughs> with ginger pigs and ginger our children, yes. even more ginger children. <laughs> and everyone's having a nice plate of gruel. More gruel, daughter. Oh, gruel. Delicious gruel. We love gruel. Uh, but the boy wants to play with this little that thing. well. I bet it's full of fecal oh. matter. Oh, it's where are the villagers shiting? I bet they're just crapping in the well. Oh. Get us a drink. Shall we play now? He's got a little voice. Shall we play Shall now? Shall we play? And you think, oh, he's a dodgy I'll one. Cl- close your eyes. I'll play with you. He's like, oh, oh. Do with the spaver. Do with the <laughs> bucket of water right over his head. <laughs> the spaver. A spaver. Oh, God, you're so northeast. Uh, did you ever play catch? Yeah, yeah. you did. But you it was would called go, Foxy. They would go away and they would just go home and leave. No, it was you. called Foxy when Foxy. you were a kid. Yeah, yeah, Foxy. Moth to the candle flames. A moth going about. Oh, yeah. Th- there's a lot of symbology. Somewhat um, a bit on the head. Mum and mum and dad are making a fresh daughter. 
pumping away oh, in the room right. next this, door. And this is the way it would be in a well, village. Well, they said in Glasgow, the little tenement flats people lived in, you were all in the same room. Oh, my So, yeah, mum and dad, and they had big families, so mum and dad had been going at it like a steam train every night. Oh. That's abuse. That's terrible. But she just looks up and goes, oh, they're fucking again, goes, I'll get back to no, sleep. No, she does not in the morning, she goes, mum, does dad tell you that noise? And the noise, no, no, no. You, yeah. you think you know a lot. But her mum... Mm. Uh, talks to her about the sexuality in a much more positive way our than her grand. Her mum's the sensible one. Uh, she's the sensible one. Yeah. That's right. I like this. The, yeah. Um, it, Does he hurt you? It's like, no. But Granny says that men, and she says, yeah, but women oh, can do it as well. Women, she, yeah. She's she, tough as well. Yeah, Don't worry about Don't it. worry about that. She's been, probably the Granny has been, the, her husband's left her. He's fucked off. But I should add, I've, I've made a note. Uh-huh. I'm mildly freaked out at this point. I'm actually a nerd. This is building up. I'm just a nerd. It's a sexual, it's a sexual potency of the film. I thought this there. film, the the way it affected me, would go as an adult. Christ, but worse. no, I'm actually freaked out at this point. Mildly. You'll never pet a wolf. No, fuck wolves. God, I better put that. I, I bought you a ceramic doll for your... No, for maybe, God. A fucking ceramic doll can there. fuck off. And if these doll. cunts here that are watching, I know that they think they've got it in their head now. Oh, we're going to send some in. I'll smash them. I've got, a th- I've got a thing. It's g- I'm going to take it down next time. And put it up. There. I'll smash it. No, no, but it's not a ceramic doll. I'll put it if it's scary. No, it's on not scary. Film, I'll just smash it. No problem. So he, the ginger's back. God, you've got a lot more notes this time. You put some work in I this. I was stuff. fucking shaking. Jesus, this is this Wait, is a look. coping mechanism. That's a lot. That's a lot of notes. The wee ginger guy shows up with shit. He's 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 wooing hat and he's, his monkey that's flowers. Right. Oh, his flowers were lovely. And his, the whole village just doing washing. It's a dirty place. Dirty. He's in the mud. Oh. So that'd be your main income. Do uh, sort of your neighbours washing. Uh. They just give it to your neighbours and you pay them. Old granny, but granny's like she needs a tablet. She's like she's not happy. She's like stay away from my favourite granddaughter. Oh, Granny tells her that if a, a kid is born, mm-hmm. I've got to this bit yet. I think we'll have. Oh yeah, if a kid kid's born feet first, feet first, devils get get them right. And then now, it co- was it feet first, eyebrows together. That's exactly how I was born. Yeah, yeah. You were born in the call, the bag. Yeah, like a boiling a bag chicken. Same thing. Same thing. Jesus Christ. Try to take you back to Marquis. They're like, Madam, we don't sell inferior meat in Marquis. It looks like you've bought your son from food Anyone food else save. would be offended, but I'm completely aware I'm <laughs> inferior meat. <laughs> completely. It's a nice cut with his glowing eyes, but it's a it's a car. It's the car. It's a car. And you're like, weird, it's Why a, is the car it's coming this here? It's wood, and then there's a car. There's a car. And Screams. the lassie is the chauffeur, and she's got yes. the blonde Diana Doors vibe. And like, what's going on here? And the this chauffeur, is weird. the driver, the devil, is the Terrence Stamp. The devil is de- Terrence Stamp. You know how Terrence, they were getting get Andy Warhol to do that. Oh, that would have been lovely. Andy Warhol, the, he wouldn't travel. He said, you have to come to New York. And they said, we can't oh, do it. Oh, that's right. He was scared of flying. Scared of flying. Yeah. Funnily enough, it was a gun that got him in the end. <laughs> the, um, not a plane. Uh, the <laughs> and he's shit art, but oh, he's uh, terrible. Uh, yeah, just a bland creature. But Terence Stamp agreed because he was friends with Neil Jordan. He agreed to do it if he bought him a nice suit. So he bought him that nice suit. So that suit he's wearing in it. That's he's, a suit, yeah. He's so, so it's so nice. He went. I'm just going to wear it for filming as well. And That's he hands wonderful. him. It's a pervy scene. He kind of gives him a wee. Don't use too much. Gives him a wee f- flask. Yeah. Drives off, and the kid just rubs, rubs it on his, his nipples. Chest. He gets a hairy chest, and then he gets raped to death by a bush. Puberty. Pubes, yeah, but that, the, I think the I bush told you when my pubes appeared. I just, Forty. I got. I, no, I got up. I, I went. I got up in the morning. Went for a shower and had pubes. But the one day when I went to my bed, that's what happened to me with shaving. Just, yeah, but the, my uh, I I was a late developer. Uh huh. And everyone you're getting changed to school, and everyone's got pubes. Uh huh. And I got one. But it was like a fucking car aerial, and it was like a wire that came. Did out it look like Homer Simpson's head? It ju- but it's straight, straight. You couldn't even bend it. Oh, just it's like one. Brundle fly. Yeah, just one. Jesus Christ! Right in the middle at the top. And then did it split and multiply? Uh, about a year later, they started oh. coming through. But I had this one pube that I tended, like a like a Japanese garden. I looked Bonsai. after it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because you never wash, there'd be a lot of fertilizer down there. The the priest, <laughs> the, the police priests up a tree in Angela Lansbury. Granny's been a bit rude about him, saying he's deaf as a post. Dickhead, yeah. Soft as kittens, soft as snow. She gives him the little, the little. Uh, 
Ev- Nigel, he's like, I can hear you, you old bitch. <laughs> yeah, but he's still nice. Even, even Evergreen needs pruning, but he's got a twinkle as well. Yeah, he's nice. I like that. And then we cut back. So the the, the ginger wooer, and the dad's quite happy. He says, "Look, he's a neighbour's kid. He seems nice. He's an know. apprentice blacksmith, so he's got Ooh, a trade. He's got, money. He's got yeah. a trade. He's happy to send his daughter off." It, the the um the but now mo- the redness uh-huh. represents her blossoming. Mm-hmm. This is her starting to become an adult. She's going. She's entering puberty mm-hmm. and everything that comes with it. Yeah, and it, it gets a bit on the nose with that later on, which I get a bit annoyed at. But you're in the church and the the old old priest's giving a bit of a sermon, going on about can the the, the lamb the wolf lying with the lamb and it's all yeah about. yeah. And the suckling child should put his hand in the hole of the ass. What the hell's that? I don't what know. is that? Is that is that in it? Bible opens spiders, isn't it? Spiders, yeah. I see. I don't know what that represents, but it was there. And Brian Glover turns out he's a father <gasps> of spider the and the hair. fly. Yeah, I'm trying to think what it represents. There was an old lady who swallowed a fly. You know that thing? She followed a spider that wiggled and wriggled and spiggled inside her. She keeps sp- swallowing stuff to kill the last thing she's swallowed. Oh, she ends up swallowing a horse or something. A horse, or right an now? elephant she swallows or something. Oh my god! A Dundonian a, a chip shop. <laughs> That'll be everything. He, that's my boy. He likes. He's proud of his wee the fruit of his looms. The and fruit everyone of his loins. watches them. Aye. go and walk him because that'd be a big deal back then when wooing well, starts. People did that. You went out for a walk mm-hmm. and you were watched. Societal well, pressure. Is, I think it still goes on in other places where you know on the wedding night you have to display the bloody sheet and everything over, and everyone's waiting. They for used it. to because well, obviously the hymen Horse breaks hair hot. here. The um the, the hymen the hymen breaks yeah. with horse riding or any vigorous exercise. Yeah, so you got. And they used to put a chicken heart up there. Oh God! I heart. know that uh, to this day, young men mm-hmm. will cut themselves and put the blood on it. To Jesus Christ! It's a weird world. In Invergowrie, maybe, but no. well, there, the in this part of the world, Just it was horses. Ah, oh. oh, Jesus! And he's in for a kiss. His breath will smell like turnips, won't it? It, uh, there's no now, toothbrushes in this film. This bit I think has all got meaning. Yeah. Where she runs, he tries to kiss her, she shoots him down, but she climbs a tree. Climbs up uh, the shaft of the tree. The shaft of the tree. She's got the red on. She's got the red on. A red catch o- me, catch me first. Yes. Giant mushrooms. Yeah, there's a lot going there's on. There's a lot going on. She gets to the top. It's an ominous mist. But there's a nest. That what's, is the, a, what's the bird that flies away? It's a stork, yeah. Yeah, it's 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 not subtle. It's a bit on the nose. It's a bit on the nose. Lovely scene. This was a, there's a, a, a mirror mm-hmm. and one of the eggs hatch and it's got a little baby in it, a ceramic baby, which sheds a tear. Yes. That's I think it's a fair, beautiful. Fair. But terrifying. Is that Jung, Jungian or Freudian? Uh, that would be... Shafts are all Willy stuff. I would say Freud, this was Freudian. Yeah, I Willy, would say this Willy was Freudian all about this. because, well, you notice as well the mirror. Uh huh. She's becoming vain, self-aware. Oh, there's oh, sorry, there's a little pot of rouge as well. She's yes, just, yeah, she's yeah. becoming the, the sexuality is coming to the fore. Yeah, it's the, creepy. He's lost it's her. Creepy. He's going back to the village and sees a slaughtered cow. It's been eaten, and he starts shouting, "Wolf!" Now, wolf, wolf. I know they had a slaughtered cow, which looked like a real one. Yeah. But they put a baby coo next to it. It's called a calf. A baby coo. It's called a calf. A baby coo. Can that not be traumatic? That, for rem- the baby that coo? reminds me of you know <laughs> a, a, that boxer guy that fought Muhammad Ali. Jo- a, the guy that's got the George Foreman George grill. George Foreman, great grill. He had a farm. He lived right. in, and he, he had his grill, and he wanted a bit of steak, and his wife had bought him this steak, and it wasn't a good enough. He said, "That's not a steak. Come with me." And he took her out to the barn. Mm-hmm. where he had a sledgehammer. And he killed a cow with his bare hands and then cut off a big slab of meat and said, that's a bit of steak. I Still think, had uh, the black What's happened to gentlemen? I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and he's ran back in, wolf, wolf, and David Warner's no happy. Where's my fucking daughter? He gets him in the back and of then, the breeks. Yeah, and it's a like whole fight. The whole th- everybody's got this pent up aggression. Abdi's swinging the punches. But... but this is this represents something as well. But the women well. know it's a mother being sensible gets a yeah. bottle of water, cools their dander. Why did why why are they fighting? This is the men are realizing they're losing their children. He even says uh, at one point, "We'll lose her one day." He's losing uh, his little girl. Uh, He's already lost one daughter, and it's in this it's to death, but it's actually to yeah. sexuality and boys. Uh, You'll never have your little girl back. She's away. Sad. The the men of the village go wolf hunting. He says something. 
you really have to kill them before you kill you. That's okay. That's. I mean, that's offensive. sensible. She's getting like a baby bath. She's bathing her. She seems a bit old for your mother to be just bathing you. Would you be sat in a bath at 12? No, and, uh, that was an awkward moment. Different times, we'll say. Uh, and it, Brian Glover's doing his usual. Call these wolves. When I was a kid, they were big. They were bigger than that. They were big giant. Wolf. They use a poor duck as bait. Now, I thought this. Now, because I was so traumatised at uh-huh. this point of the film, oh, I thought that was an emotional support duck. I just assumed it was an emotional support Did duck, you, and then they used it as bait. I was well, like, no. Uses, when they were making this film, they used <laughs> the duck as bait, and it's a real wolf, one of the two wolves. Yeah, big fucker. The wolf jumped, and it got scared by the duck, and fucked off, and refused to come back on the set, so they had to get the other oh, wolf wonderful. in. That's good to so know. So the wolf was scared by the duck. Oh, but yeah. John, because they're real wolves, and we'll, a wolf could be kind. You can't train them, really. No, you can't. You've got to and be careful. They can behave themselves, and they can be, but they can go. They had snipers on set. Oh, for fuck's sake! And John uh, Neil Jordan said, "Look, if if it does anything to the kid, shoot the wolf and then me." He says, "Because can we? My life's not worth living if something happens to the wee lassie." Now, as the sniper, because a lot on of this. children have died on film sets. Oh yeah. And you've you've just shot a wolf, and then Neil Jordan. Do you think? Wait a minute! Do I have to kill it? I was, is this in my contract? Am no, I going to be arrested? Said, he, said, he said. He said. So well, fuck. He's him. like, what? Take the shot. <laughs> Take the fucking shot. Oh, Sitting on his director's chair, saying, "I'd have that big microphone. You, you just shoot, shoot right through it." it. Right. Uh, so it clearly wasn't an emotional support duck which I needed at this point my cat wouldn't even come in because he was scared because I was shaking he fucked off I needed something I was I I could have put it off at this point again I was like this is too much but she's safe she said thank god we're safe indoors her mum and her that's right douse the lights and all go up into the trees the people and they're waiting it's quiet and then it cuts and he's coming the, the, well, the, the mother she decides to tell the mother a tale she tells her a story now this is pure 80s music video isn't and it and this is yeah this bit I um, I kind of like it because I, I don't right okay this it's, scene it's just it's it's the gl- it's the gluttonous idle rich and they're all scene, they're all the powdered lead paint on their face and the wigs I'm going to put what I put and they're in a now we get to the scene that has scarred me it scarred me so deeply Aristo Pratt's there's <laughs> There's nothing that can stitch this scar together in my life. And now I'm about to watch it again. The pe- Do you find it, the noise a peacock makes is quite terrifying? Oh, they're... Imagine yeah, the pet peacock and I was in your bedroom under oh, the bed. Oh, they're noisy bastards. <coughs> ah, all night, they're noisy. And they're just this gluttonous scene. as people stuffing their faces. And it's all wet music. and they look ugly. They're made to look ugly. Well, they've all, you know those beauty spots they put oh, that's, that was, that's to cover pox scars yeah. and stuff. Oh, God. But yeah, just, just hot. That stank, though. Perfumed, but you, people didn't wash. I met this Hocked. girl. Uh-huh. When I was... For, for Adam, for years. It's an Adamant video. Yes. And she had a... Uh, what do you call it? A mole. Uh, uh, right. And I'm getting to know her. A couple of weeks later, the mole was over here. And I was like, am I losing my fucking mind as usual? No. And it moved to here. She used it to cover spots. More at that age. But Tooth, I know toothpaste. I, I thought, can moles move? The problem And it can. never dawned on me that it was just a fake yeah, one. If you'd had maybe a facelift, it would move about your body. Yeah, exactly. Have you seen that? Katie Price's new facelift. Bless she, her. She's on the TV, but she goes to get it done in Turkey. Oh, God. And it's just. It's, it's like I did it. It's honestly around the back of the kebab shop. I think shop. someone's put a knee it's in the so back of cheap. her head and just pulled. The thing is. It's it's just terrible. I just feel sorry for her. She's seriously. She's gave got, up on her elocution lessons this year. Gen, she's genuinely <laughs> got problems. I watched her. Uh, well, she's some titsu model, which is fine. Do whatever you want. Mm-hmm, but mm-hmm. she tried to. They, they tried to rebrand her as a mummy role. Yeah. So she was in Freeman's catalogue and had her in like Blue Water shopping centre. Right. Something. Okay. And she's on. She's on this seat and she's had. She's getting model like mumsy clothes, but she was like that. <laughs> They're like, Katie, no, this is... <laughs> they couldn't have got her. Just... <laughs> you do know the people watching this screen grab everything we do. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, That's well all done. she did. <laughs> Wait, Ken, she's got she's got a son and she's got a kind of lovely relationship with him. It's all yeah, fine. Yeah, that's wonderful. But she's just, she kind of get out of her own way. But you don't that's go to you don't, you don't go, go to Turkey. You don't go to Turkey. The thing is, she's not skint. Spend the extra couple of grand. The thing here. is, she's she's she, she thought she was a, she thought she was a billionaire at one point. 
she's been telling people she's a billionaire but there was a time she she, she reached a peak of money she was oh there. yeah and she should have saved it get, like, a, get a cleaner for that fucking house because she'll live in a big house but she want to own it it's all on it's just she, she's doing her money she'll phone the Daily Mail and say she's on a beach in mm-hmm. Turkey she's had her tits done yeah and then the photographer that's her revenue it seems like these these models or are girls like this the they're bankrupt. They've but lost everything. Who, then two weeks later, they're buying a two million pound jo- house. Nobody knows who she is. Yeah, that's Out, true. Young people have no they've idea. No idea. She's just a monstrosity to them. They'll look mm-hmm. at her and go, "What? It's, it's an odd. Oh, it's a shame." Yeah, um, I agree. An angry, so, another Dundonian woman appears. She is Scotch. <laughs> yeah. Definitely pregnant. She's a Scottish maniac. Right. Yeah. Many a wedding has been spoiled by a Scottish person appearing drunk and this, heavily pregnant. I've been to one wedding. Where someone turned up mm-hmm. drunk, oh right, and claimed they were the gay lover of the. Oh, groom. that's good. Cool, cool. They were just a random guy that turned up and was apparently known to do this. Oh, that's drunk that could as be fuck. Awkward. <laughs> it was awkward, but very funny. <laughs> <laughs> I was at a funeral once where a woman jumped on the coffin as it was getting lowered into the ground, tried to open it, oh. and she was she was having an affair with the. Really, the dead person. She maybe thought her watch Before was in there or something. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. Um, the wolves <laughs> in the forest are more decent than you. And she oh, looks in the yeah. mirror and starts cackling, laughs, nah, throws uh, back her head. And the mirror shatters. The way it's done is beautiful because you don't get a full glimpse of That's, anything. I think that was more powerful than the actual transformation yes. scene. But they've got wolf masks on. But the wolf ma- oh, it's so creepy. I don't like it. I don't like it. The shoes splitting. Oh, and, and the. Hairy tits, and the, actual hairy tits, yeah, actually, and the teeth. Say it is, you've got to have tits in it, yeah. but they're there's hairy no, tits. There's not really much tits in this. A film. hairy tit, one hairy tit. It's wonderfully absurd. It is, but that's what makes it scary. Yeah. Then it turns into a lot of wide angle shots, which makes it disconcerting. Then it, it it's, it's the like, camera's it's, pure, it's, a, it's purely like a, it's Dundee, a nightmare. It's like a Dundee wedding. It's, it's exactly no. That's why a Dundee, Dundee wedding is a then nightmare. Just seeing it's always something funny about seeing animals in human clothes. So they've just put these and they put the clothes on, on them, the and they all run out, and the poor peacock gets Tramp, run over. Trample it. They trample it. And she, but it's, it's a bit. She then salutes the staff. They're, yeah, and, and they're they all, all they all both, thank fuck. And then and this scene should be taken out the film and burnt. And then she, from terrifying. then on, she was serenaded by the wolves. So she'd have the baby in a swing, and then yeah. the wolves would come. And it was the pleasure power. would come from knowing the power she had. She'd got the better of them. That's it. So this is her story. So That's a good. It's yeah. It's good. It's fe- and the mother's female like, empowerment. The mother realizes her daughter's grown up. Where did you know that story? That's not true. Can she like? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Meanwhile, the men of the village are still just waiting. Waiting in silence. And then the young ginger-headed kid goes, Wolf, shut, shut the, the fuck, fuck up. up. The wolf appears it and they closer. obliterate. Falls down the hole. Falls down the hole. The duck gets away. The, the emotional support duck okay. it makes it okay. makes us escape. Mm-hmm. Thank God. Because see, if that duck got killed, I'd be finished. I couldn't uh-huh. make it through this film. If they dug a deep enough hole, they wouldn't have really had to have shot it. They just wouldn't have given it away. They wouldn't get it. They wouldn't but they just it. shoot it. And then we cut back to the and he, the dad David Warner reappears with something. But he's he's and troubled. He says, "I swear it was a big grizzled wolf, mm. and I cut off its forepaw as a trophy." I swear, I it was swear a four it was a forepaw, and here it is, and it's a hand. It's a we hand. ring on it. Oh, and it turned to a man. Oh, what what was it? A wolf or a man you killed? Whatever it is, it's now it's dead, and it meat it's just become meat. Mm-hmm. And they go. Oh, what we do, hand? We'll bury it in the garden, throw it in the fire. But the Imagine girl, the smell. Oh, the smell! But the girl, she wants to touch it. Ah. She's drawn to the bad Well, as boy. a child, if you'd ever see a dead cat or something, you you would want to touch you, it. You poke it, but I think this is a bit more sexuality. Snazzy ring. Oh, throws it on the fire. Sizzles, like gam and steak. So. They're trying to, they're, they're doing everything they can to stop this girl. Don't grow up too quick. Yeah. Don't grow up too quick, this, but it's too this, late. This fucking werewolf's going a bit. Daytime. Apprentice Blacksmith. He's got She's good prospects. Getting ready to go, grannies. And people keep saying to me, Lassie, you're not afraid of anything. You're just a remarkably brave person. Mm-hmm. Cheers. Cheers. And the ginger haired guy's thing. whittling the stick. He's wee phallus. Yes, he's whittling. And he's like, can you go for a walk with me? He says, after the last time. Yeah, it's, like it's a bit, mm. So, the white rabbit, and it's going. snowing now. That's it. But, 
they run up to what seems to be their main it's like uh, income. Broig, it's like Broig, glass, Broig, Broigle the Elder. Broigle's picture. The snow is beautiful. The snow. Done. But the, the, the glass mine. Glass oh. chips. Yeah. <laughs> oh, money in that. <laughs> They've wasted their time. Do frogs like the snow? I would. I wouldn't think. I don't so. think so. I don't. But would they have been salt they would have used? So that poor wee oh, we'd been, frog stingy. We'd, we'd have died badly, really badly. So he said she's out in the woods. Yes. She loses a ginger guy, and she meets a wonderful character. Now this character mm-hmm. is mm-hmm. instantly mm-hmm. rapey. Well, his name is Misha Berges, and he is a choreographer, and he was brought in to teach a a rear. Poise. Oh, well. And the director said, This guy's extraordinary. So they he is extraordinary. Do you want to know why? Aye. Same cheekbones as me. He's sharp cheekbones. High cheekbones. He, he's, a, he's a proper dandy. My mum used to do him a embroidery, and there was one, the blue boy thing, and he dressed in the rough. Yeah. So it's like that. He, uh, this guy has a, a real presence in the and film. He kind of steals the show, to be honest. I like. The chatter between the two of them because yeah. it's not perv. It doesn't seem pervy. It's she's it, she's a, she's she's young, but the to and from is good. It's yeah. it's a, it's a, she it's holds a, her on. It's a meet, it yeah, and it's a meet and equals. I think some people might be a bit awkward when you realise how old she is. Oh my god! But the thing, I think she holds her own. I think it's absolutely fine. His eyebrows meet joined together. Oh, oh fuck! And he's got his tricorn hat, and he's dangerously French. Dangerously, dangerously French. French. Oh. He goes, I have the most remarkable object in my pocket. <sighs> and so that, I never get like, lost in the woods. Go. I know, yeah, here we go. Uh, uh, and this re- is all about the grooming, to be honest. And he's drinking booze and yeah. eating oat cakes. And it's all that's a wee it. bit... And that's and he, exactly and how it looks you spend like the put, weekend, does not it? a chicken nugget in his mouth and does that thing. Do you do that with your cat? You put food in your mouth and the cat eats it for your mouth. No. you never done that? Fucking no. Why not? It's, it's a fucking cat. Oh, well. We'll just talk about the cats eating vomit from my past. No. No, I try it. Well, g- try something long like a pepper army. Have you done this so, with your new cat? No, not yet, because he'd take your head off. <laughs> <laughs> he's a very gentle cat. When you give him a little treat, he's very soft. Is he sitting on you yet? Oh, yeah. Oh, wonderful. Sits wonderful. On, well, he doesn't be so, li- he lies on you. Is he facing away from you yet? He does it. He does anything. Oh, really? Do that's it. good. He lies that's nice. Back and shows you a belly. But if you were to try and scratch his belly, he would probably tear He'd you kill out. you. He's not at that stage yet. Okay. Yeah. It's a compass he's got. No, he's willy. A compass. And he, she says, she tells him about the wolf, the, the wolves with their hair and inside. She, he's like, that's superstitious. Don't believe nonsense. that nonsense. And he actually says werewolves. You've not heard You've the not expression heard that, werewolves. But yeah. he brings up werewolves. And he goes, you deserve to be punished. Oh, oh. Uh, it's, it's then he gets a slight music teacher vibe. <laughs> Can have music teachers were always the <laughs> Yes, they ones. were always the ones. And he decides to have a little game, a race to Granny's house. And he's going to use his logic and technology. Yes. Compass, and she's going to go. And he says, whoever gets there first gets the prize. That's it. It's, a, it's, uh, a, it's an odd one. And he one. goes, take my hat and just wear it till we meet again. It's a good hat, feather in it. But no no one notices. She doesn't say, how do you know the way to Granny's house? I know. Missed out on that. No. So anyway. He's just going to be the way. This whole thing's a bit rapey and a bit grooming. Well, he gets there first using the compass. Yes. And he's 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 the huntsman, so he's got a bloody cock in his cock. He has a bloody cock. It's he, a literal di- bloody cock. He dips his finger in it. He's, he's no very clean. He's a little bit <sighs> In, he go, chaps at the door. She's like, come away in. It's no, it's no lock. <laughs> it's no lock. I would keep my fucking front door locked. If you knew there was werewolves about. I would lock the front door. Just a latch. I saw, I'd have a loaded pistol with some silver bullets in it. And a latch and sit at the door all night. That would be my TV. Aye, I would just yeah. face it. But. He's like, oh fucking hell, and she spots and she's like, she knows fuck. right away. But she's not giving up. She's putting up a fight. <laughs> she though. puts up a fantastic she, she, fight. She, she's whacking him all over the she's place, punching him, His hitting him. Tongue with the... comes out. She whacks him with a oh, hot poker. Hold on, his tongue doesn't come out. <laughs> His two foot long tongue just flips. Oh my, I hate it. I'm scared. And she whacks him in the hand, he grabs the poker and his hair, it's, 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 it's singed oh, hair smell. Singed hair, oh. Have you ever burnt your hair? Yes, oh, I stink. used to have hair down to my waist. And you caught fire? And one day, I was making popcorn oh. at the, and it caught fire. Oh, of course And I did. cut it to about just above nipple length, uh-huh. just to all match, and it never grew any further. It never grew it again. got a flag. It, got, it, it was traumatised like me with this film I stopped growing when I saw this fucking film And he's fucking howling With the pain 
Because he's not a great, he he's not a great fighter. He's not a great anything. No. He's just got the power of being a werewolf. Yeah, and he whacks her, and she just head comes off, and it's uh, a china doll. Oh, startling! Almost Start- want to cry. I'm so Start- afraid. It's a startling image. I had my mum crocheted me, you know, the cover. Uh huh. I, I had it in front of me. I was sorry. I was sorry. I didn't like it. I was sorry because I did I tell you I did a kindness the other week. Oh, what'd you do? An old lady at my work took a funny turn. Oh no! She was dehydrated, but her pal, her old pal, thought she'd had a stroke. Mm-hmm. And I was very nice to her. Got in a wheelchair and everything. Got a taxi. She came in the other day with a big box of chocolates for me. They're all gone out the lot. <laughs> and I saw her yesterday and thanked her. She's she's fine now. Oh, that's. But lovely. she felt like she was made of porcelain. I remember I was in the Overgate shopping centre, <laughs> no, the Wellgate, and an old lady yeah. had got herself stuck in the escalator. Oh, right. So she was blind as a bat, mm-hmm. and she was scared. She, she was we going up, and she just was backtracking. So I said, don't worry, hen, I'll get you. And I just grabbed her and picked her up and then went forward with her and plonked her down. <laughs> and she was like like a moth. She weighed nothing. Oh, Grams. God. <laughs> and I says, what are you doing now? But she was away out to the butchers to get some mints. I've never done a niceness to a person in my life. No, I do. I do. Old I've ladies, never done it. you've got to, old ladies and kids. Anybody else can fucking look after themselves. All oh, right. And he, she, um, she arrives late. Oh, she's like disappointed. He's sat there. Yeah. She's, oh, oh, you've fuck. watched. Bit, just... And she goes, "Where's Granny? Oh, she's out at the Woodpill, and then she smells like, shit. Nah, she smells bullshit. Shit. Yeah. A real gentleman would not let an old lady go out on a night like this. And she looks, steps on Granny's glasses. Oh, and the hair, she, Granny's hair's burning in the fire. She knows she's dead. He says, oh, you, your kind can't stomach hair, my kind? And she says, yeah. Yeah, what she big knows. Ha- what, and they do the thing. They what, do the, yeah. yeah. What big eyes you have. But they do that again in a minute and it's, it's different. Yeah, it's it's like effective. It's like an adult reworking of the whole thing. Yeah. Your stomach, your kind can't stomach clothes. What have you done with her clothes? A, and he says, I love the company of wolves because there's wolves. And all the wolves are outside yeah. waiting now. She pulls the gun. Yeah, she sneaks to the window. Turns his old gun on him. Shoots. Bam! Fucking, he goes. And he gets a right flag. He's like that. He and gets he's a right goes, floor. <laughs> he's like you in the bath. He's on all fours. <laughs> <laughs> and what big arms you have. All the better yeah, to hug you with. Because she, even though she knows he's dangerous, yeah. she's attracted. She's not scared. To, she's not really but she's scared. she's attracted yeah. as well. She's cautious. Yes. You fine gentlemen. What big teeth you have. All the better to eat you up with. Oh. Bang! Oh. Fucking right in the arm. And, and he screams. It's a well... Like, it's a well edited transformation. Oh. Because they don't obviously have all the animatronics. So he's just contorting on the floor and yeah. it's at angles. It's, 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 it's really they, quite they, nice. Done and here's well the, the, the kind of money shot of his face and the wolf. And the wolf coming out of his mouth. Right. It's wonderful. a money shot. That's a good one. And she goes, she, but he's been winged. She's injured him. I'm sorry. I never knew a wolf could cry. So she feels sorry. She feels for bad. Him. It's, it's great wolf acting from this uh-huh. point. Genuine wolf. And, she, and then she tells the wolf a story about a wolf girl that comes out of the well and wanders about and gets shot and then gets looked after by the friendly priest. That is beautiful. right, the wolf, the wolf That was girl. an actress. I didn't know if you knew the name. Her name was... No, uh, I didn't know her at all. Uh, Danielle Ducks. No, didn't and it's know her only at all. acting role. All oh, right. She kind of scuttles about and oh, she back puts in the well. It's a nice... Yeah. yeah. But there's a scene here Aye. where a bit of blood drops onto a white rose and it mm. turns red. Yeah. Uh, <sighs> Got your period. Right. That's it's a that. bit on the nose. Yeah. Your you, period's a bit uh, on your nose. She was just a girl who strayed from the path. Blood on the rose. It's quite potent. It, Sex, it's like paganism. I it's, think paganism was all quite randy. It was, oh yeah, but, the maple but, but, and everything. Paganism was, was, wasn't, was ma- Christianity is a male-led religion. Yes. Paganism was, was female, female Yeah, it's yeah. all female. Because fem- it's female, let's say, men, men, it's just the dirty, they spill a bit of dirty water. <laughs> okay, it's the women, it's a magical <gasps> bit. God, I'm, I, am I getting romanced by you right now? It's just a bit of the old pearl. Fuck's j- sake. Bit, a bit of the pearl bit jam. Bit of pearl jam. Bit of the pearl jam. Oh, and then but no, I'd like to, uh, and then so they show they rock up, yeah, because the, the, the villagers the, come to the house, they're looking for her, and the wolf comes through that through window. window. Fuck it, what about acting? That is, isn't that dangerous for that dog? I don't know, dogs are fucking stupid. <laughs> Give them a fucking bone <laughs> Well, I jump through a windy for a free bentos pie, you, you would, and I'm a, I'm a thinking animal. Uh, 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 
and go, she runs in, and the lassie's become a wolf She's as well. She's become a wolf. And they get shot. Don't shoot, don't shoot. Don't shoot. And then they're way into the woods. Now, this is her changed. They, Two wolves off to make puppies. They've accepted. Mm-hmm. She's in puberty. She's mm-hmm. grown. Mm-hmm. She has different things. Yeah. She doesn't look at her, her dad as the hero anymore. No, they're all her stifling her. Yeah, adventure. that's it. Adventure. This is it. It's like small town living. This is growing up. Because you grew up it. in Dundee, but it's the biggest town in Scotland. It's not a city. A, oh, no, no. I've often described this place. It's too big to be small and it's too small to be big. Yeah. It's uh, this a lot is, of Dundee's the awkward child of a Scotland. A lot of famous Dundonians leave Dundee, but mm-hmm. like a wolf, they come back to Dundee to lick their wounds. <laughs> yes, this is very and then true. they want to be Dundee famous for the rest of their life. <laughs> they want to come back and they want to get on honorary doctorates. Yeah, that's nonsense. Yeah. They should be banned. All this sort of stuff and the because what's his name's back? Him from the the View. Oh yeah, uh, Kyle, Kyle Faulkner. Faulkner. Got a new album out. Some oh, droning no piss one cares. No one cares. Um, and then it kind of cuts to the the house and the sleeping lassie. Yes. And the wolves come in and it's That's a right. mass of well, dogs. Dogs. But there's a bit where she wakes up and it fucking comes through the glass in slow mo. Yeah, that, that it, dog that, did that. that did it. It's stunt glass. It, yeah, but that still cuts you. Stunt glass can cut you. You don't put a dog through that shit again. It's well, eye or something. Malibu, is, no, what, what are those uh, like Belgian Shepherd thing? They'll come through windows, the helicopter yeah. off, the jump with planes. I know, but uh, they don't fly them. Do they fly the train pilots? They, they fly them. They put, Amazing. They, 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 yeah, they can fly. They That's can incredible. <laughs> motorbikes. So this is how... They it, get tight, they get this titanium. Is it, the teeth. girl, she wakes up screaming. Uh-huh. Every birth is painful. Mm-hmm. She's waking up. She's, she's eaten by these wolves. And and there's it. a bit where it comes through an oil painting. And it's yeah. backlit. Remember that Tenants advert where it was people like... Loved it. They're all Loved working, it, yeah. yeah. Like and then the, the, the dirty hand comes out and grabs the pint. Oh, that's a good advert, that. Good Did music. Did Neil Jordan do music videos? Uh, I think he'd done... Did he? Th- Did is he, he still alive? I think he'd done Must one. Must be a good age now. I think he'd done one. I think he might have yeah. done a Madonna one or something. I'm not sure about that. Oh. Yes. I think he's 72-ish now, uh, if I remember correctly. Age. No, this is a... It's a nice little... Curiosity box. This I like this. It's, it's a little great, jewel it's of experimental. A, I it's, wish it had a, a maybe given it a little juju up a bit. Maybe the copy is a bit bad. Yeah, could, could there be a better version of this or somewhere a cleaner cut? Um, I would imagine so. It could be updated, Good. and I think maybe some new filters on it to yeah. give it a more dreamlike effect. Yeah, because when you watch something like I had the money, like Legend, yes. every scene looks like a painting. Yeah, in yeah, that. yeah. that's a shit film, but. Every scene in it looks it's like be- a painting. It's got Tom Cruise in, in his bad teeth period. His bad teeth period. That but was yeah, his best period. That is a very, yeah. That was, that is it a more better. effective adult fairy tale? I don't maybe think so. I think this no, is I maybe think, more effective. Uh, the Company of Wolves is probably the most effective one because I, never, I... I had not watched this film since it was on video. Right, okay. Well, I've seen it since trying no. to deal with my trauma with it. No. And I thought, and I'll say, this is an absolutely amazing, great film and highly recommended. It's yeah. also terrible. Don't watch it. The lassie who acts in it, it's a very understated performance. Yes. She's 12, yeah. remember that. That's a, it's it's just a very a, mature just a, performance just for a 12-year-old. Yeah. Knowing turn. It's good. It's very good. There is a knowing. Um, you can you see it in her expressions. She's, you know, she Everyone's great. good. Stephen Rea's superb. He, the dan- dancer guy, he's probably the best thing in it. Oh, he's wonderful. The Huntsman's really, really good. He's, Angela he, Lansbury's he got a real twinkle. Although, yeah, she is terrifying. Yeah, really. You, it's, you it's, don't know her you motives don't know, at all. But then you realise. It turns out she's just made out of ceramic. Yeah. She's a scary doll. Oh, it's terrible. How many rocks? Have you ever seen that film, Asylum, where Herbert Law makes a wee doll to go and kill the doctor? Oh, Jesus and Christ. It, when the guy stamps it's like a. Remember those to- Tommy robots? Yeah. So it's like that, but it's got a human head on it. And when the guy stands in it, it's got a wee harp and everything beating in it. It's if you, it's no. one, It's a vignette film, a series no. of. Yeah, please watch Traumatizing. it. Traumatising. How many films? I'm going to give this 10. 10 right. I was right in the mood for this last night. I give it 7. Yeah. I think its limitations do Budgetary hold back what it could have yes. been. I think this could have been an all-time classic, mm-hmm. um, but it misses out because it just, it's obviously because of restraints, budgetary yeah. uh, restraints. Two wolves, three trees. It's, but it could have been so much more. Mm. 
if this had a proper budget, this could have been an absolute classic. Okay. Okay. I think it had enough going I think for it. The, I'm, I'm glad because the listeners who watch it maybe never sleep again. They'll never sleep again. That's that's what's going to happen. They're, they're I quite, didn't get to sleep till seven this morning. They're quite flighty. They're flighty. I just put on the Xbox. They're a flighty a, bunch of people. I hate it. Imagine watching. It. Imagine watching this in VR, just existing within it. No, I'd kill myself. That fucking noseless sailor boy coming oh, after. Oh fuck no, man! I couldn't do it. Giant dolls. There is something creepy about ceramic dolls. My mum one year, her day was a hairdresser, and her the lasses who worked with her bought her a doll, and then they started buying her more of them. Oh okay, no! Because she she didn't like them, but yeah. They, so there was an attic, and there was a, a load All of these them. faces watching, you. watching. You. <gasps> I couldn't do it. It was terrifying. It's a lot of fingers. You know who you are. Who am I? You're the village. I'm the village itself. Muddy and dishevelled. And I do functional. I, I, functional, yeah. You. Mm-hmm. Apparently I'm a fucking wolf No I'm just waiting on no, it No that's not dangerous No you're not a wolf No I'm an ineffective wolf I, I admit <laughs> But I've got all the I symptoms I don't know I think I think you're like A, a kind of Toad in a cold day Kind of, kind of ch- A chilled Chilled frog uh, Continue I know you're not a wolf You wouldn't be able to eat the meat You'd be one of those dogs That's always chewing grass And then making itself sick <laughs> <laughs> Can that green frothy spew they used to do? Ah, oh, so I put the end of this. Uh, you're the wee ginger haired guy. You oh, like technique, that. yeah. Not rapey, but you, no, not rapey. But you, you you get knocked down and you get right up again. That's me. That's, that's you. my life. Uh, you're a glass half full kind of person. Oh, very much so. Yeah. And you're a muddy village. I'm a muddy village. Yeah. I wrote at the end of this. Uh huh. More trauma, no sleep, and the constant worry I'm one step away from a bonio addiction. Do you have oil paintings in your house? Uh, no. Any pictures? <gasps> I, I do. Do, I do. big enough for a wolf to jump through? I do have a picture, an oil painting. I got a, a portrait done of my cat. Oh God, I've got two cat portraits. Beautiful. It's a beautiful one. The cat Actually, if anyone no. wants a portrait of their cat, Sarah Halliday Art. Dot com or uh-huh. dot co uk. Uh-huh. I can't remember, but look for Sarah Halliday. Well, well, I've She's got an oil, amazing. I've got an oil painting of my last cat, and it's by an artist called Charlie Roy. Give oh, him a look. Find Charlie him. Roy. Charlie Roy. Sarah Halliday. Mm-hmm. She has uh, great prices yeah. and wonderful art. Ch- Charlie Roy is really good as well. Great and Charlie prices. Roy. Wonderful great. stuff. Great. Well, give them a go. Give them a go. Excellent. Do, yeah, g- give a, an actual artist a go. Yeah, um, it's worth it. It's worth it. It's, it's worth it. When you get it, the car won't appreciate in the slightest. You know, but you, will. yeah, that's it. But I remember seeing paintings like the Hayween. Uh huh. You see it in a picture, and you go, "It's a, it's a painting." Mm-hmm. And one day I was in. Now where where is it held? Is it the British? Mm-hmm. Is it the mm-hmm. whatever gallery oh, it was just, in London? I can't remember. Matter, and matter. I turned the corner. Uh huh. There it was. Oh. And I went. I get it. It's become a bit kitschy. Yeah, my but granny. When you see the real yeah. thing, my, I went, "Oh." My granny had a the Hayween. A texturised print I thought it was a real paint It was oh. a hayway Yeah <laughs> that It was that in a nice frame Or blue million yeah. That's the one thing When you go to a granny's house Or whatever uh, oh. And they've got one oil painting mm-hmm. They're convinced That's my money there There's a guy in Dundee <laughs> Went to a Dens Road Market And he thought he found a Picasso picture Oh god It was a 1970s Like just a print On a piece of hardboard Yeah And he took it to the museum And they said No it's just a 1970s print On a piece of hardboard And he thought They were trying it over on him So he went to the local press And said he was trying to be conned And this was worth millions I wonder oh. what became of him Well actually I did find something Of great value once Uh huh In Dens Road Market What did you find? Closed. They had Dundee's a little cafe Dundee's bar of soap No you'll understand this Hold uh-huh. on uh-huh. Had a wee cafe bit. They had old arcade machines. Oh yeah, yeah. And do you know what I had them for? Ten pounds. Oh. And I was looking at them. The guy went, "Mate, if you can get them out of here, they're yours." Fuck. Two original mm-hmm. Space Invaders. Ah. Uh-huh. They had the games now that I know are a, a Frogger original, but they had games that you don't even hear about. Can't remember their names. And I looked into them, and they're going for. Tens of thousands. Well, I when I was a student in Glasgow, we found this original Space Invaders arcade in mm-hmm. a skip, took it home, plugged it in, and it worked. They should, because it's all like one board yeah, and a, a in tube. It well, they were all there, but I had nowhere just to put left, them. We'd left it in the yeah. flat when we moved. You just that's what happens when you're yeah. a teenager. You're not thinking. In you terms don't think of, of things that. like that. But this was, I would say, probably about two thousand and six. Fuck. 
It wasn't that they hell of a long ago. They'll be in the skip. They'll be burnt. Yeah. But they were all working because they were oh. on. They just left them on all the time. They'd been on all these years. Oh. And they were there for £10 each. Or I could have them all if I could just get them out of there. Oh, that makes you sick, doesn't, doesn't it? Doesn't it make you sick? Because yeah. I know a lot of people watching oh, this people, would have killed for them. There's people tenting right now. Just uh, but the, yeah, but Blood's but flowing into places is not flowing. They've enjoyed this they're review and they've of, heard that information. They're feeling a bit wolfish. And their day's been ruined because now the wolf's coming out and they're mad at me for not picking them up. And there's, there's, they're not there anymore. They'll be gone. But oh, then again, Then again... The Dens Road Market was just closed one day and everyone had to get the fuck out. Mm. They might still be in there. They used to, uh, if you bought a can of Coke for Dens Road Market, it would pop because they just stick them in the freezer. Yeah. They didn't have a fridge. That's right. So it was just frozen cans of Coke. So you'd pop them and there'd be a little bit of juice and then a block of ice. <laughs> That's good. I ate there. I had a hot dog and chips. Oh, in the but Oh, God. Oh, my. Oh no. What a place. I got a pen in there. Uh huh. Right? And it was just gold effect. And, uh, you know, metal though, and I uh, thought it was really good. And I had a friend uh, in this in London, it was a birthday, and I thought, you know what? An old vintage pen yeah. would be a nice thing. So I got a nice case for it and sent it to her. And her cousin worked in a jewellers or something, got it valued. It was solid fucking gold. Oh fuck. And I thought, bet it's lead, because I had that weight to it. It was solid gold. Oh, but you poor to be fool. fair, no, no, no. She says, I'm keeping it. But because of that, if you want me to sell it, I'll sell it and just split it with you or whatever. Uh, and I was like, no, nah, don't be daft. It was solid uh, gold. And that was out of... Uh, yeah, I, 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 well, you kind of really right. So it's, it's no. a, a solid gold pen would be wasted on you. Cocks I draw. Speaking of which, have you seen the, the lift in here and all the cocks the, that are drawn I in I like it? to call it a... Pro, it's the finest piece of art that's been produced in a what is supposed to be a studio full of artists. Well, someone had drawn a cock on it. And it wasn't a, you a and it wasn't me. cock, no. Nope. Which is amazing. So there's someone else in this building that enjoys this art form. Mm-hmm. So I added six a or seven. A cluster. A cluster of cocks. Now this has grown into... A bouquet. This is into a mass. A mass. A mandala of it's, cocks. It's, no, it's like a, it's like a sea anemone. Yeah, it's just everywhere. There's yeah. cocks everywhere on this poster. And it's, it's going to come down eventually. But someone has drawn testicles on the, the wrist, the hand. The wrist, the wrist, the wrist, 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 wrist. That was you. Wrist, that was me, I admit to that. Because you wrist. put time on it. Yeah, you you must have went up and down to get it. Just no, right. no, it was one journey. Oh, no, I'm not wonderful! Sa- not sad enough to have multiple journeys to draw cock. You done very well. The looks yeah, really it's good. good. It's good. Well, on that note, thanks, people, ladies and gentlemen. Washer, check if there's hair within your balls. Oh my god! Because the worst kind of balls are the balls that are hairy on the inside. Not <laughs> That's the inside. worst kind, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> highly recommended. Yeah, do you it. You will be traumatized. Until More next. Traumatized. Until next time. Later. Ta da! Ta da!